Hi everybody, welcome to our daily release class. So make sure that you are standing. So this time we're gonna start standing. So keep the same with hips, knees and feet. Mm -hmm. Your feet parallel. And again, try to use your feet against the ground. So always kind of pushing the ground with your feet. And we're gonna start first, just bring your hands at the back of the head, one at the top, at the back of the other one. Bring your elbows in and only the head go down. Bring chin and chest without forcing. Be careful to don't lock your knees. Press your feet against the ground. Feel the release in your neck. And we hold here for four breaths. For four. And three. Two. And just one more. Bring your head up, release your arms, bring your arms down. Roll me the shoulders backwards for four, three, two, and one. Bring your arms up, we squat slightly, and then we go hinge forward and forward bend to forward bend. Let the hands drop beside your feet, and again, if your chest is not close to your thighs, bend your knees. So don't worry to keep the legs straight. We try to keep our chest really close to our thighs. Let the head drop down. And we're just going to hold here for four. Pushing your feet down. No pain at the back of the legs. If you need to bend a lot your knees, bend your knees. Let's go for two more. Inhale. Exhale. And just one more. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale to prepare. Exhale. Push your feet down. Roll up the spine. Slowly, vertebrae by vertebrae. Make sure that you exhale in the way up. Bring your arms up all the way. Interlace your finger. Push your palms away. Let's stretch towards to your right side. And back to center. Let's go on to your left and back. And again, right and back. Left and back. One more time, right and back. And the last one, left and back. We're back again to the squat. I'm gonna turn around. So we squat down slightly and then hinge from your hips, forward bend. Make sure that your chest touch your thighs. Don't try to extend me the legs and go very far from your thighs. It won't really work for our stretch. So better to bend the knees and let the chest really touch our thighs. Feel a nice stretch in your glutes, your back, and of course your legs. This time we hold our elbows with the opposite hand. We let the head drop down and we just hold here for four. Deep breath, exhale, let's go for three, exhale, push through your feet against the ground, two, engage your dummy, and just one more, release your hands, inhale, and exhale, roll up, we can keep our legs bent, try to don't feel pain when we are stretching, okay? Let's go one more time. Inhale, bend your knees. Exhale, hinge from your hips. Hands on the ground. Step backward, right and left foot. Come on to all fours. Shoulders above your hands, hips above your knees. Keep the same with hips, knees and feet. Index fingers pointing forward. Spread the fingers on the ground. And we try to press with our fingertips on the floor. And we're just going to go inhale we Tuck the pelvis in, chin and chest to curl the spine until the neck. And exhale, move our hips forward, arching our back. Try to exaggerate bringing the tail out and the chest up. And look a little bit upwards. And let's go again. Inhale, cat stretch. And exhale, cow stretch. To don't have pressure on your wrist, press with your fingertips. And let's go for two. 
and exhale to have a deep breath and the last one inhale and exhale back into neutral we push our bum down onto our heels as far as we can go if we cannot go too low use your elbows and you can keep pushing with your hands against the floor your bum backwards okay if you can go all the way down you can extend your arms but try to don't let the weight collapse in your head and we hold here for four breaths inhale deep no pain no forcing let's go for three two And just one more. Back onto all fours. And this time we're going to bring the right arm under the left and bring the right shoulder under the floor. We slide the left hand forward and we try to press with the right arm on the ground and with the left hand so we don't let the weight collapse in our head. And we just feel a nice stretch here. Keep your tummy in to support your weight so the weight won't collapse in your shoulders and we hold here for four anytime we can close the eyes and really feel our body let's go for three two and just one more Bend your left arm and push your left hand down and come on to all fours. Let's go on to the other side. So bring your left arm under, shoulder on the ground. Slide the right hand forward. Raise with your right arm on the floor. and Sorry, your left arm on the ground and your right palm. And we hold here for four. Engage your tummy. Exhale, feel the stretch in your back and your arms. Let's go for three, and two, and just one more. Now slowly bend your right arm, push your body up and come back onto all fours and let's go all the way down back onto child pose again if we cannot go all the way down bring your elbows on the ground and push yourself with the hands and we extend our arms forward and we just hold here for four and three Two. And one more. And back onto all fours. From all fours again, shoulders above your hands, hips above your knees, curl the toes under, push through your fingertips, and we go all the way onto downward dog. If our heels don't reach the ground, we don't force them. We want to extend our back. So press with your fingertips and push your tailbone upwards. We are going to inhale as we lift the heels. And exhale, bring your heels down. And again, inhale up. Exhale down. Feel nice sensation. Let's go for three. Down. Two, down, and just one more, and down. Slowly bring your knees onto the ground, and we just rest back again onto child pose. Extend your arms forward, and we just hold here for four. Two. And just one more. And 
back onto all fours good and we're just gonna sit down again if you want to do it again it will be brilliant if you have the energy and the time do it again and your body will feel fantastic so you can repeat again all the stretches bring your hands back again into pre position we inhale as we bring the arms up and exhale as we drop them down you try to exaggerate these breaths inhale and exhale and one more inhale and exhale hands back pray position and we say namaste thank you to join us see you in the next one